think a lot of people probably get up in the morning and turn their tap on or flush their toilet and kind of take it for granted the water is always going to be flowing. And uh, there's a big process in what goes into providing safe drinking water and that's what we do every day. The Parks Department is responsible for maintaining all of this. The beauty of our parks, it has an amazing range of things that it actually does. Uh, we sort of take care of all the different technology the city has, computers, printers, uh, cell phones, uh, pretty much any technology the different departments use, we sort of help support and keep running. Roger, staff to zero proceeding. We're at the Cam River Airport, we're actually on Taxiway Bravo. We're uh, going to go out and do a runway check. Really, we have to do a check every time the conditions change, which means um, when it gets wet or when it dries off uh, or it freezes. I like how our focus is in providing um, fun and experiences in the community, bringing the community together at special events. My job includes basically looking after the, the gardens here in the park. Uh, and I think it makes the city look more beautiful. I'm the Fleet Service Coordinator here and primarily I take care of managing workflows for our other mechanics on staff as well as ensuring that uh, the work that's being done is done in a safe manner. Interesting part of my job is that no two days are ever the same. Every day is different whether it's teaching a class or meeting people or helping people with their workout goals. We're a department whose responsibility is bringing all of the major projects to completion, ranging from large-scale projects like the recently completed artificial turf field project here at Robron, all the way to smaller utility projects. As the transportation specialist, it's my job to look after our roadways, our sidewalks, our crosswalks, our bike lanes, our traffic signs and our traffic signals. My main role as an Accountant 3 with the City of Campbell River is preparing the operating budget, which is the day-to-day -day operations, preparing financial statements on a monthly basis for management, and quarterly reports for Council. As a wastewater service provider for the City of Campbell River, we operate this state-of-the-art treatment facility, which removes contaminants from the waste stream that comes here from the household users. So I work in the green space and I mow grass and do lots of odds and ends so some of the benefits of planting trees and making sure all the sports fields are nice and tidy and ready for any events that are going on. I tend to spend most of the day out in the community and driving around the city enforcing some of the rules and regulations and looking out for uh, things that, that should be put right. My job as the city manager is to ensure that council's strategic priorities are implemented on the ground. I'm really fortunate to have an excellent group of staff that work with me and collaborate to ensure that those objectives are achieved. Oh, working for the city is awesome. The job's really satisfying because we are largely self-directed. Our boss lets us bring forward ideas. I think the best thing is the people. There's a bunch of great folks that work here and uh, we work together as, as a real team. Our city is quite a young city. There's a lot of young um, kind of rising stars within our management group and um, it's neat to have an organization who really values that. I work with a crew of three other guys. We are always on a four-man crew. When we have calls we're able to bounce stuff off each other, work together as a team. I live with these guys uh, on days and nights, so they're my family away from uh, my family at home. The biggest thing I like about my job is that how responsive we can be here in local government. That's not always the case in necessarily the private industry or the federal, provincial, other levels of government. Uh, when we have an issue with our infrastructure and the public lets us know about it, we deal with it quickly and we deal with it well. Uh, a lot of times we hear back from the public about that and that's probably the most satisfying thing I can hear is that we've had an issue and we've resolved it and really made people happy. I love the team that I work with. I've been doing GIS for 20 years now and this is by far one of the, the best teams I've ever worked with. Everyone is very professional and respectful and they're so passionate about the work and uh, working for the, the public. The city is a great place to work because 
It's a small enough place that you can be involved in pretty much everything, but it's big enough that there's plenty going on. So we have a variety of different uh, work projects that, that we can be involved in. And uh, we've got a great team here. And we, we have a lot of fun as well. I find, you know, any department that you walk into, people are always smiling and laughing, and it just makes it a joyful place to work. Working with the city has given me the opportunity to learn a lot and to develop personally and to grow. There's been a lot of different areas that I have been able to dive into. I think the impact that we bring to the city would be just the extra hand and the extra mm -hmm. perspective that um, us students can give the city. Yeah. I mean, I'm sure we do things differently. And yeah. they really appreciate that perspective and really listen to us. Yeah. I think it's a really exciting time in Campbell River with our downtown revitalization and making the transition from a resource-based town to services and I think the future looks bright. We're seeing a lot of interest in development. We're expecting to see a lot of exciting new things happening within our downtown over the next few years. The reason I came to Campbell River was because of my husband's job. What keeps me here now is I can't imagine living anywhere else. I absolutely love it here. Every time I go away, I always wait to come back. I mean, we have a great place to work, but we also work in such a beautiful city. Like a couple weeks ago, I was walking to work and there was a pod of 12 whales, and I don't know where else you could get that. Campbell River is a fantastic place because you never know what you're going to see. If you're living here, you may be seeing elk on the way north on the highway. You could be seeing collections of huge numbers of migratory birds, winter storm watching, and beautiful fishing. It just really never ends. I find that the best thing about moving to Campbell River was how affordable the houses were. When we moved, we bought a house, a beautiful big house with a big backyard, and we're very happily raising our two kids in it. There's no way that we could have afforded to buy a house in Vancouver. The ocean, uh, forests, and I love the mountains. Scenery closely followed by the water, and uh, and the community, it, it's, all, it's all in one, it's all encompassed for me. Um, it has everything we need to, as, uh, for both a job and also a young family growing up. We have a number of young staff at the city of Campbell River. With young people comes enthusiasm and an interest in really pushing the boundaries of what a city can achieve. The function of the city and the operations and the services that we deliver are only as good as the staff that we have. And um, in order to do that, you have to have an environment that really facilitates growth, uh, succession planning and opportunities. And, and uh, I think we have been very successful here in Campbell River of doing that. And what that means is that you have staff who are very productive and you have excellent customer service and that bodes extremely well for the future of Campbell River.